Well, my experience is that it is important to not to stop being active, that you have to walk at least half an hour a day, if you can, and that you should do exercise or some stretching exercises like Pilates or yoga every morning for about sort of 10 minutes. And I think it's important to do it quite regularly every day because if you stop doing it then you get stiff and then when you start again you will tear a muscle. So it's important to be active and walking is very important that you don't sit at home all day, you go for a walk. And um, if you can go swimming, it's also nice because it's relaxing and it's like the movement in the water is very, very pleasant. So whatever exercise you do is very useful for all the people. It, I think it helps them to, well, to keep active and to keep a good member of society. Well, but that's, I think, mainly that people should uh, talk to other people and read and uh, try to be, well, mentally active, try to um, really um, think about things. And be uh, part of a group is quite important to actually be part of some discussion group or go to lectures and discuss the lectures. It's, well, I am going to be 90 and I came here and you know, it's very good for me. You know, you have to actively engage in something. And the friends that I have, they either do some painting or etching or they do writing. But they do something that is not, as you say, not just watching television. But it's quite nice to watch television. <laughs> and also, it's very important to spend time with young people. Because if you only are with old people, that's not a very good idea. So I think I spend a lot of time with my grandchildren and they are asking very interesting questions. And I'm learning from them a lot. It's, I think, very nice to have young people around you. I do, I do use a laptop and I do uh, quite a lot in, on sort of arranging photographs and things on my laptop. But I'm mainly learning from my children and grandchildren. If I need anything, I just ask them, come and do this for me. They're very fed up with me. But I think that you should, I think it's important that old people should use this new technology, I think. But I don't think they should use too much of the iPhone because then they sit there, that's very passive. Then they look all the time, there's an email there. <laughs>